where Am I audible? Hi, yes, we can we can hear you. Okay. We apologize for what's happening. We have a lot of uh, technical situations. So we're trying to fix this with the platform. Okay, and uh, right now I am sharing my screen. Uh, can you confirm that you can uh, see it? Yes. yes, perfect. You can see. see it. Okay. And my time start now. Yes, perfect. Okay. Okay. Uh, when the time will start, just uh, inform me. Okay. Sure. Thank you so much for joining. Um, we're experiencing, as Manar said, some technical difficulties, but this Zoom meeting is good to go. So um, we're just waiting a couple of minutes. Thanks for sharing your screen. It looks fantastic. Yeah. And wish me good luck too. I've been right now in contact with the COT and also the team of Wikimedia Foundation. Right now, um, there's a screening of the Ukrainian video and there's a seven minute delay. So um, if you could hold your presentation for seven minutes, um, that would be great. So if we take- Seven minutes, right? Yes, if we consider that there's two minutes to go, that would be nine, nine minutes. Okay. I can I can let you know. Um, no problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Okay.
Thank you very much for your patience. We'll let you know as soon as we have more updates. I know we're just waiting to start, but please just hold off a little bit. Okay. The video of Ukraine is rolling in feed loop. Experience still some technical difficulties, but no worries. We hope to get this settled before this meeting starts. Um, thanks for your patience. I just see a question in the chat, what's going on? Um, right now they're streaming a video from Ukraine on Feedloop in the main stage. So we're just waiting for that video to end to start with the meeting. Thanks for your patience. We'll notify you as soon as we can give you green light. If you have further questions, please make sure to put them in the chat. We'll be happy to attend them. And thanks again for your patience.
Well, thank you very much for your patience. But now we are ready to start, as Manar was saying. So we already have green light. Thank you so much. And please go ahead. Okay, can I start now? You can indeed. Good luck and oh. enjoy the conference. Okay, thank you. Okay. Hi all, my name is Orota Pontul. My username is Artulu, and I am from West Bengal, India. I am the member of West Bengal Wikipedians user group. Uh, I joined Wikimedia movement uh, last six years, and I uh, develop I develop and started a project with name is Wikilabs Butterfly. So is a uh, Wikimedia funded science-based uh, science uh, project. It is a project about photographic documentation uh, of uh, butterfly, which are available in West Bengal and the, and the Northeast India. And for past five years, we are documenting the butterfly species. Uh, What is this is the purpose of the purpose of the project is to increase the amount of free license uh, material or photographs of butterfly in the Wikimedia Commons. We also develop article in Bengali Wikipedia and English Wikipedia too, and also we are contributing the species documentation in Wikidata and Wiki species also. And the another part of WLB project is the outreach. Program and knowledge sharing. We are also starting the interest group, lepidopterist student, and inspire them, motivate them, and try to bring them under the umbrella of Wikipedia movement. So, as I told, the last five years we are building here is the fourth WL project. Here we are documented and collected the different species of butterfly. If we look into the statistics of the WLB project, you can see that the graph are already inclined. Till now, we are able to capture uh, 4,500 4, plus uh, images to the Wikimedia Commons. Among them, three, uh, 300 plus number of images are quality images, 14 are featured image, and uh, very much mentionable that we are able to contribute 170 plus valued images, which are the first time we are able to uh, contribute live images of butterfly to the Wikimedia Commons. And uh, till now, uh, till now we are uh, able to 500 species and subspecies we are able to cover so far. And in this field, uh, uh, apart from myself, another 20, member they are working uh, to document the butterfly species like in in a regular species so next question what what is the conservation and what why it is essential we are already know about a uh, little bit or very much about conservation but in a brief i can say care and protection of resources so that they can persist for future generation uh, now I am I say that tiger species is in danger. Most of the people can connect with me what I am trying to say because they know the what tiger species is and how they look like, what is their habitat, what is their behavior or characteristics, and anything. But if I say that khaki silver line is in danger, I, I can bet that no maximum number of people did not get my point what the khaki silver line is so see what the khaki silver line is this is a very tiny butterfly species common name is khaki silver line these are also endangered in india in india under the wildlife protection act this uh, species is under schedule one that means they are very much endangered or uh, they are in actually danger uh, actually in danger. So if we did not conserve the species from right now, maybe after 20 years, 50 years, the species may be disappeared from India. 
here is the difference because we because the proper documentation is not there that's why we did not connect to the species to species uh, and uh, here we are trying to build the gap uh, that's why our team is trying to uh, trying to um, the bring bring this situation and fulfill the gap and trying to bridge them with the resource person to the common people role photography in conservation first of thing uh, that photography directly hit our mind when i said tiger previously uh, some of images is already in our mind so photography directly hit our mind our pop up our emotions and it is the easiest way to communicate strongest tool uh, and connect huge number of people at a time next see some pictures uh, yes the butterfly is actually peeing the this is the uh, butterfly named white dragon tail and uh, this is the salient feature of this butterfly is the peeing activity this is the male specimen and what he is doing that this is uh, this situation is called mud puddling uh, he sucking the water and ex and uh, taking the minerals for their further reproduction and uh, release the excess water to the nature so see here it's not a image it's basically a story uh, so that this is the com and uh, so that common man can relate with this that this is the also uh, its behavioral pattern another is uh, this species name is a common is orange those wings and they uh, dry uh, mimic as dry leaf when it's open lots of color are popped up like orange blue uh, uh, black you can see in the image so when you see the uh, open winging is oh it's amazing it's really colorful because it's already pop up our emotions another uh, characteristics is the mating pair which is very important for reproduction of every species to survive further uh, and here in this picture that all the butterfly are uh, sitting calmly in the tip of the finger actually most of the people know that people uh, know that butterfly are uh, fond of nectaring not all the butterfly are fond of nectaring they also like sweat that's why they are sucking sweat from the fingertip and uh, sitting calmly in the tip of the finger and here the another species its name is black raja raja means uh, the king though its name is king but their food habit is little bit weird because he is taking nutrient from the poop so see the the this is the difference that we are trying to document different different habitat different different characteristics of the butterfly so that common people can know very much or ever about them we are also trying to uh, we are also trying to capture Uh, or documented the life cycle of the butterfly because we all know butterfly are being metamorphosed in their whole life and there are different different stages is there so we try to document this because if uh, if the common man can relate with the in any of the stage may protect them or may maybe they became curious about the different stages of butterfly and if they became curious that is the turning point i think because when they become curious they did not spray the pesticide to kill the caterpillar because most of the are Uh, they may be harmful they are poisonous they may bite you or something like that but and also destroy your plant but uh, uh most of the butterfly caterpillar are not harmful as people thought so when they did not use the pesticide or they become curious maybe that uh, that point they will wait and watch how the butter the adult butterfly will emerge from the cocoon and spread his wing to the earth and 
that in that point the people will convert it into the conservationist and that is my uh, further view actually that's why we are also trying to uh, cap you know, trying to develop and catch capture the uh, the little little thing and one thing when we cut the uh, cut the garden cut the weeds and wild flowers and something because we called them wide uh, weed because we don't know their uh, name out of uh, out of our knowledge we are doing that when we cut the weeds and plant and shrubs we are not only cutting the plants we also cutting the ecosystem too because there is small small ecosystem they are growing in our surrounding area we just ignore this out of our knowledge so we already know the visual is always more powerful than words and our project is totally based on macro photography as you see the egg is very tiny and uh, sometimes the plant is also uh, very small the nectar plant is the flower is very small here is another the life cycle of uh, dark banded bush brown butterfly and uh, and uh, and this is the egg which is 1.2 millimeter in diameter and why we are uh, concentrated on butterfly that uh, is only it is that colorful creatures that's why uh, I think no because it is uh, first of all butterfly is the uh, butterfly is the very uh, very important part of ecosystem as butterfly is known as a bio indicator that means if your area in your area, the butterfly population is very high. That means in your area, the plant diversity is also rich. That's why they are here. If, if the butterfly is uh, uh, struggle to survive in your environment, that means your environment ecosystem is not that much good. Maybe it's need improvement. That's why they need to, they are struggle to survive in that area. And one thing that butterfly are the good pollinator. And in my country, in India, uh, the one part of economy is based on agriculture. So butterfly also help to develop the agriculture and sustain a good economy of our country. Here is the glimpse of our field documentation. The I and a group member doing the doing field and capturing the uh, tiny colorful jewel of the earth and here i just uh, very happy to uh, announce the news that we are very lucky to have this rare uh, gynandomorph of color sergeant species in this picture you can see the both wings are looking different actually is gynandomorph is a situation you can see the left side of the butterfly species is denoted at the female characteristics and the right side is also denoted as a male character which is very very rare and we are very lucky this is the first time we recorded the live specimen uh, and this is the first record in india so last of my slide i i am happy to help uh, who, i am happy to help to who are willing to do the same type of project can contact with me directly. I am very happy, very pleased to help them uh, with my knowledge and my experience of last five years of my journey. And um, because every species is equally important and they have specific role in ecosystem and in nature. Okay, thank you. And Naya, thank you so much for your presentation. It was fantastic. Any I'll question the is there? Um, and I, because of timing, yeah. we need to cut off the session right now. Uh, okay. Thank okay. you so much. But um, if you have any doubts, please email us, or you can also in the networking tent contact with the attendees as well. So okay. thank you so much again. Thank you.